Hi, this is Jeremy Bell of Sleepy Daddy Software. I'm going to be showing you an app that I'm working on that will be released when uh, Mango comes out to uh, retail phones later this year. Uh, that shouldn't be too long. They're, they're already released uh, to the manufacturer, so that shouldn't be too long before it gets into the hands of users. Um, and uh, what a Telnet client does is basically log into a remote server that um, can output text. And basically the, the uh, main use of this is going to be for logging into MUDs or MUSHES or in other words text-based multiplayer games of uh, various kinds. Um, and it's pretty cool. Uh, it's got color support as you can see down here. I've uh, already disconnected to this server from this server. Um, but here you go, you can actually, this is what you see when you start up, minus the text down here. Uh, you type in the host up here, the port, um, you hit connect. I'm just going to do a new client here. Um, growl, growl deer or something, I don't know. And uh, so you type in what you want to send to the server right here. And then push enter and it gets sent to the server um, and once every time you push enter the uh, what you just typed is selected automatically so that if you press enter again it'll send that same thing again it's just useful in uh, in situations like this for example when you want to retype the password um, don't use password for a password <laughs> Uh, anyway, and also we do have ANSI color support, so uh, we're going to say yes here, and then it's going to start giving us colors. Uh, that's pretty cool. Um, and there you go, that's pretty much all there is to it. Uh, you log into MUDs just like uh, you would with a regular Telnet client, and uh, you type things, and it tells you what to do, and, uh, and there you go. I'm just going to create a character here. And there you go. Bam. So, as you can see, this is a mud, so you can you can click here and to to see the whole screen if you want to read the whole thing. It's easier to read sometimes. Um, you can also use your uh, phone's keyboard. So, this is me simulating the keyboard here. Um, and you can do that, you know, um, if you like. Or you can use the on screen keyboard, doesn't matter. Either way, works pretty well. So there you go. So down that client. Um, if you push back from here, you can bring up the host uh, menu here up uh, again, and you can disconnect. Um, or connect to a different one as you as you wish and if you want you can go back here and it goes away so there you go it's pretty simple I'm gonna be adding a few minor features like uh, some favorites menus um, things like that I might be look I'm looking into doing some live tiles and things like that um, so you will see what how it goes as things progress but I made enough progress I think that I wanted to show everybody what was going on and what to uh, look forward to. Alright, this is Jeremy Bell, Sleepy Daddy Software. Thank you for watching.